guys. I'm currently at a restaurant here. Um, at Keja Jerry. The restaurant is in Marriott Hotel. Yeah, Marriott Hotel. Um, I was invited here for like an end of the year get together. So I'm here to eat Asian food. I think it's a Wakami restaurant in Marriott Hotel in Keja Jerry. I'm going to share my experience with you, okay? <laughs> so what are we having with the rice, please? That's why you have chef tea. You still don't want to eat. Chef tea will not. Chef tea, I will not starve you people like this. <laughs> After one now. <laughs> Okay, so is this, is this is this for one person or everybody? Are you kidding me? Hi guys, out on a day, mean Fridays in Lagos, especially, no, normally Fridays in Lagos are always very hectic, especially because of traffic. Now, a Friday before Christmas, you guys, a Friday before Christmas, I've been trying to get out of my estate for the past one hour, you guys. I have been trying to get out of my estate for the past one hour. And I'm still going all the way to VI. I'm still going all the way to the island. My goodness. At a point, I might have to turn back because I don't think I can do it. I'm, I'm driving and I don't think I can drive all the way. Then, number one, there's no fuel. And there's no fuel. And just earlier this week, I filled up my tank. So when my tank is like on half tank, I try to like top it up and fill it up because I like to fill my tank. I don't like to buy like maybe 2k, 3k. I filled up my tank just on Monday. And today is Friday and my tank is already on half tank. This is because I went to the island twice from the mainland and I got into traffic twice. That means the traffic consumed my fuel. Now I'm on half tank and I'm trying to get to the island and I'm sure by the time I'm back, it's going to be empty. Anyways, I just hope I make it to the island so I can show you guys my activity for the day. Um, if not, I'm, I'm just going to turn back home. I'm going out with my friend, my girl. I'm going out with Buki. We're going to the spa. We're just going to treat ourselves because, you know, it's been a very, very hectic year. And we just feel like, you know, we should, we should spend the whole day together um, at the spa, do lunch, and just, just hang out for the whole day. Um, so that's why I'm going to. I, I didn't want to drive. I felt I, I, I should take Uber, but I now saw the Uber fee, the cost. Hey! Oh Shelley. That's why I enter my motto. I am going to drive. God please. I am even scared to check to, uh, to check Google Maps because I know it's gonna break my heart. So let me just Kori Bon now. Kori Bon means make I just enter now. Um I think I'm gonna change my nails. My nail color. So um recently I decided to start 
doing like short nails instead of long nails because just because of course i'm a big deal <laughs> no actually because i got tired of um um long nails and i just feel like you know let me just do short nails for now so all my nails going forward are going to be like my normal my natural nails um length so this is my natural nail length but if i want my natural nails to get longer than this i i know what to do so i wanted to show you guys choose for me i have some a couple of um um nail polish colors that i that i want to use today so this is one this is another color and this is another color so let me show the three of them which one do you think what do you guys think what do you, what do you guys think which one should i use um i hope that by the time you watch this video i'm able to choose the one you select the road is free in front so let's do this man let's do this meanwhile there's nothing they don't sell in lagos traffic call even onions they sell a whole my 12 in lagos traffic i just passed through a guy that sells tomatoes i saw the one that sells bell peppers that's um tatashi and this one i saw the one that's, that's selling onions so my question is do people really buy this pepper they buy it in traffic that's quite strange man who buy pepper in traffic have you ever bought pepper in traffic before if you have please let me know how did you negotiate huh i would be so scared to buy pepper in traffic or beg i'd rather just go to a, a roadside seller or you know I'm on the island right now and I'm killed in a gas station. You guys, corruption has eaten so deep in our system that even we individuals practice this thing unknowingly. You know, it has gotten to a point where if you don't join, you might just be lacking behind. And this is not me saying that if you have opportunity to, you know, just be just be neutral, please do. Like I was driving past the mobile on um, um, right before um, Silver, Silver Bed. I was I was driving towards the mobile right before Silver Bed Cinemas, and you know there, there's been a lot of traffic. Like traffic has been so crazy, you know. And then I got I got close to the mobile gas station, and I noticed policemen, last mile officers, all of them right there trying to like pass the traffic. And apparently, what is causing the traffic is. They are letting people into the Philly, the gas station illegally. Um, so if you if you're driving past and you feel like buying gas, join instead of joining the long queue, um, they just signal to you that you pay one thousand naira. If you pay one thousand naira, they will let you in. And because my gas is very low, I had to do it. Like I feel so bad right now, but it has gotten to that point where you know you can't even you can't even you like because the there's fuel scarcity and all that I, I don't even know when i'll get another opportunity to buy fuel i've been buying fuel from my um, one gas station beside my estate and i've been buying it at 250 naira is it 250 naira or 283 naira and that's why i had to feel i, I could feel i was filling my tank at 21,000 20, naira and i'm like how long will I, will, I, will I continue this i just filled my tank on monday will i now fill my tank for that same amount today again you know so I was just like, okay, let me buy it at normal price since I'm already at mobile here. And you know, I had to, I didn't want to work 200, under 1,000 naira. I had to give him um, 900 naira. It's so sad that, you know, we have to go through this. The rest to, left to me, I will just, you know, call their bluff and just move on. But I need fuel. And it's quite, it's very, very sad. Like, man, it is well, man. It is well.
I'm about to get on with my massage. I got here really late, so I could not do it with booking. So she has done her own and she's waiting for me. I can't wait, man, because I need this massage so badly, man. By the way, this spa is so good. I'm going to show you guys around when I'm done. You guys, I've spent the whole day in Buki's house. And guess what? I did not shoot any vlog muscle. We slept. I slept. I ate. I slept and talked. Anyways. Yeah, we're still talking. Anyways, you know, I still have some more hours to spend here. And, um, you know, every time I'm here, I can't bring out my phone and record because I just want to dive into the moment. That's why I do not film anything because we're just like literally chilling. Yeah. We're just chilling. So, you guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Eh? Bye bye. <laughs>